In Vanilla Blender, creating numbers of simple materials and assigning them to the selected parts of your model can be really annoying. Each time you need to create a new material, you must go to the shader editor, tweak a lot of settings, pick the right color and then, in the edit mode, assign the material to the selected faces. This workflow is pretty acceptable, unless you work on the large project and need cr to create dozens of materials like this. To simplify this process, we've created Surface Painter the add-on that does almost all that work for you. All you need to do is to select the desired surface base, pick the color and click on the object that you want to paint. And that's it! The goal of this add-on was to keep it simple. It takes the selected surface, paints it with your specified color and assigns to the selected area of your object. All the operation is done just with one mouse click. You don't need to do anything else. The plugin will convert your selection into the new material or use the existing one if possible and will assign it to the certain part of your model. Surface Painter has several paint modes that are limiting the area that you're painting on. Starting from a single face by the area limited with the sharp edges or UV seams to the entire material slot or object. What is really helpful is that the tool may be used both in the object mode and the edit mode, so you won't need to switch between them just to do one operation. To make the entire workflow even easier, all the surfaces are tweakable from the panel level in the 3D viewport. Inside the item panel you will find all the input sliders of the surface node groups used by the selected objects. That allows you to quickly twitch each surface to your own needs with no effort in any moment of your walk. For this moment there are 27 variations of most basic procedural surfaces like plastic, metal, chrome or varnishes and each of them can be painted with the unlimited number of colors. The add-on comes with one default palette of colors but you will also be able to pick any custom color from the color picker. Furthermore, your favorite colors may be saved locally in your scene or globally so they can be reused in any other blend file. You can also easily create your own surface nodes and save them with the add-on, what gives you the possibility of expanding the surface painter just the way you need. Except the main paint tool, we've provided some other useful features, like using the color palettes for any color input inside the shader editor. You will be able to use any color from the default surface painter palette or from your favorite colors for literally any color input of the selected shader node. That can help you to transfer the exact colors from one input to another with no need of using advanced techniques or even copy the color settings into another project by using global favorites. Surface Painter is suitable for any type of scenes. It will do a fine job in architectural or interior scenes, while crafting custom assets, when creating concept arts or just with any other kind of work you do. Simple usage makes it reachable for any user, no matter if you're a beginner or advanced. You won't need to spend tons of time on learning how to use it. You should be able to run it and jump straight to painting your objects. Grab Surface Painter from Blender Market right now. You will find link to it in the description. If you like this video, hit the like and subscribe button to stay up to date with all our products and with other Blender videos and tutorials.